this video we will see how to fix update error code 0x800f020v on windows 11 and windows 10 if you are also facing such type of issues windows update failed to install or windows update error code then here are the fixes the first workaround is right click on the start button and choose settings here from the left side of settings page go to system settings here from the right side look for the option troubleshoot Click on troubleshoot. Here choose other troubleshooters and run Windows update troubleshoot. Click on run button and follow on screen instruction to complete the Windows update troubleshooting process. It will take some time and follow on screen instruction. Choose as per instruction display on your Windows update troubleshoot page and check whether your error is resolved or not windows update installing or not if not go to the next fixes right click on a start button and choose run in run dialog box type the command c l e n m z r clean manager clean m z r click on ok this cleanup wizard will open here select the drive you want to clean up basically c drive where your program files exist click on ok this cleanup wizard will open here go to the section files to delete and make the check against all these options temporary internet files delivery of images optimization file recycle bin temporary files thumbnails make the check against all these options user file history and click on ok a pop-up window will appear are you sure you want to permanently delete these files choose delete files the disk cleanup utility is cleaning up necessary file unnecessary files on your system choose continue and wait for few seconds it will clean your system there may be a possibility of your storage issue and catches clear catches and cookies will help your windows update error the next one is right click on the start button and choose run here type services dot msc click on ok this command will open services windows in your system you will have to start or restart windows update related services and the first one is background intelligent transfer service look for background intelligent transfer service right click on it and first choose a start and if you find it already in a start mode then restart background intelligent transfer service in my case it is in stop mode so we will start it thereafter apply a double click on it to open its properties windows and go to its starting a startup type section and choose automatic and finally click on apply and okay to save the changes apply this method for all other windows update related services and the second one is cryptographic services look for cryptographic services same process right click on it choose a start and if you already found it in a start mode then restart cryptographic services apply a double click on it to open its properties and set a startup type as automatic and choose apply and ok to save the changes the third one is windows installer services scroll down and look for the option windows installer services same process right click on it choose a start otherwise restart apply a double click on it to open its properties but you can't change its startup type so simply close the windows and the last one is windows update services right click on it choose a start otherwise restart windows update services apply a double click on it to open its properties and go to a startup type and set it as automatic and choose apply and ok to save the changes after that close the services windows and check whether your windows update installing or not if not go to the next fixes go to windows search and here type 
cmd and open command prompt windows run as administrator mode choose yes command prompt windows will now open here execute this 3 dism tool as shown on a screen execute all this 3 dism tool one by one in command prompt windows dism online cleanup image scan help dism online cleanup image check help and dism online cleanup image restore help execute all these three commands one by one followed by enter key on each time and thereafter execute the command sfc slash scan now and press enter it will scan your system for any corrupted or bad system files and repair them accordingly wait till 100% verification complete after that close the windows and don't forget to restart your system after restart your system check whether windows update error is resolved or not your windows update installing or not if not go to the next fixes again go to windows search type cmd and open command prompt windows run as administrator mode and in command prompt windows execute this windows update components first execute these four commands to stop these four services execute all these four commands one by one followed by enter key on each time in command prompt windows and thereafter execute this windows update components all this command path will also available in my videos description box you may copy from there execute all these four commands one by one to start all those four services you have earlier stopped them so now start it after that close the command prompt windows and check whether your windows update error resolved or not windows update installing or not if not go to the next fixes manually download and install your windows latest update open your chrome browser and here in search field type the command microsoft update catalog open first appeared result microsoft update catalog here in search field type the desired desired command kv update which you want to download and install it in your system and click on search and click on download and install button on your appeared result so manually download and install windows latest update through microsoft update catalog that's all